Hello everyone, welcome again to another Jira Cloud tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to close Epic in Jira. Now, as we have already understood in the previous tutorials that all the issue type, be it, you know, Epic, Story, Task, Subtask, in Jira follow a defined workflow. So whenever we say uh, issue closer, uh, so it doesn't matter whether it's an epic or it's a story, it basically follows a predefined process that you associate or predefined workflow that you associate with that particular issue to follow. Now this workflow is by default available in Jira so you can use the default workflow or as per the project requirements you can customize this workflow so that it suits your project's need right now when we say how to close an epic in Jira it's basically moving that piece of work or moving that epic within that workflow or across that workflow and then moving it to the closed status or the done status of that particular workflow. So if I go to a particular project now, there will be four projects basically that I'm covering in this particular tutorial. So I'll walk you through um, the different you know ways to navigate to Epic and how you can basically close Epic. Now closing an issue is a very simple task. It's in the tool, it's basically following certain steps and navigating to the right windows to basically close. Now, when I go to the classic Scrum project, uh, if we open the project, you will see in the left hand side in the backlog, if I go in the backlog and then in the backlog, I go to the epics, right? So there are certain epics here. So say for example, portal registration is an epic which has two issues in it. Okay, so if I click on portal registration epic, you will see that it has two, ep two user stories and usually you will close the epic once all the issues are done or completed within that particular epic. Now, in Jira, you can have the automatic closure of the epic once all the issues within that particular epic are completed, but by default, the epic closure needs to be done manually. Say for example, this is portal registration epic. And if these two issues are completed, then you can simply open the epic, right? And simply follow the workflow, right? So in, in this particular epic, if I see the uh, workflow at the moment, this particular epic is in progress, okay? So I can simply select the workflow, whatever workflow this particular epic or uh, this particular issue, which is of type epic follows, I can simply click on done and the epic will be marked as done. So that's all about closing the epic in Jira. But in terms of process, if we talk about process, then usually whatever the user stories will be there within the epic that needs to be completed. So for example, now this epic has three user stories. One is in the backlog and then two are in the to-do. Now say for example, if these particular user stories are completed, right? Only then you should be closing the epic. Now, because I have marked these uh, mark this epic as done just to show you how you will close the epic uh, but this can be done automatically once all these issues are closed so you can in your workflow you can define that as soon as all the issues within this particular epic are closed or moved to done then this epic automatically uh, the status of this epic automatically gets changed to done all right so uh, by default say for example it will remain like this and once the issue has been done you'll see the progress is shown as soon as other issues will be done the progress will be 100% of that particular epic let me go back and then change the other one as well okay and let me refresh this page so you'll see that now the progress is shown here 100% done so when we customize the workflow then in that particular case once all the issues will be done the epic will be marked as done as well but if your workflow doesn't support the automatic 
movement or automatic closure of epic once all the issues within that epic are completed then you can simply open the epic and change the status to done so that's how you will close the epic in jira so in terms of the actual steps to close the epic it's pretty simple but in terms of process you have to basically follow the closure of all the issues that are within the epic to be closed first to be done and accepted and then you mark the epic as done either manually or through the customization of the workflow within jira workflow concepts i have covered in a lot detail in the workflow tutorial uh, that you can go through and i'll also cover workflow tutorial and customization in the upcoming advanced tutorials as well so this is how we'll close the epic so from the backlog itself as well um, you can simply go to the epic section and select the particular epic and then from this particular epic say for example uh, you have certain you know issues in the epic then you can uh, select those epic uh, select those issues and then uh, you can close those and then finally close the epic from the roadmap as well you can follow the similar process so for example from the roadmap closing the issues is very simple so uh, say for example you are managing the whole project and you see that all the issues within that particular epic has, are being completed then you can simply go to the epic and then from the epic you can mark that epic as done from this drop down status here right so this becomes a lot easier if you are monitoring the epic progress from the roadmap so this is about the jira classic scrum project now let's go to the next gen project so let's go to next gen scrum project and in the next gen project next gen scrum project the roadmap is the simplest way to basically see what exactly what all epics you have and what all stories or the issues within that particular epic are so now say for example within this particular portal registration epic you have two user stories which are currently in to do status once say for example they are marked as done or they are closed you will see the progress in the progress bar as well of the child issues and once these are done you will see the Portal registration epic green bar has been done two of two issues has been done and if you are managing the project simply go to the portal registration epic now click on it and you can manually close the epic by just choosing the drop down here and choosing the status as done or closed or whatever status is available for marking or completing that particular epic to closed right so this status is because of the simplified workflow that is available out of the box in jira but in your actual project you might have many statuses available depending on how the workflow has been customized in your organization okay so i can simply choose done and you can see the epic has also been marked as done the green tick is available against the epic in the roadmap okay you can do it from the backlog as well um, but the easiest option is to to basically do through the roadmap but you can do either ways uh, you can simply you know like open the epic details say for example you know i want to close epic one you can simply open the epic one and uh, you can close it directly by opening the epic detail so it's similar to any other issue type so working on epic or closing an epic or moving an epic is exactly you know similar to any other issue type or closing any other issue type in jira cloud projects so that's all for this tutorial how to close epic in jira hope you like the tutorial please do share and subscribe and thank you for watching